Papa, help, it hurts, were the tragic last words of a Russian tourist as he was being eaten alive by a shark in front of many eyewitnesses who couldn't do anything but watch. Welcome to another episode of Wildlife Whispers. In today's episode, we dive into the deep and vast underwater world that we call the ocean and tell the story of Vladimir Popov and his heartbreaking demise to a shark in Egypt. If you find this story captivating, remember to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more gripping stories. Now let us embark on this emotional and heartbreaking story beneath the surface. This is Wildlife Whispers. Picture yourself on one of the most breathtaking beaches you can imagine. Local tourists are surfing, swimming, laughing, children are joyfully playing, and families are immersed in relaxation and togetherness. This was the idyllic scene that Vladimir Popov and his family were experiencing on a beach in Egypt's Red Sea resort of Hergada, until tragedy struck. Vladimir Popov, a 23-year-old Russian, was born in the subarctic city of Archangel. He later moved to Moscow with his father and spent most of his life there. Several months prior to the incident, they made the fateful decision to relocate to Egypt, seeking refuge from the ongoing Russian-Ukrainian war. The exact location of their stay remains unclear, as some reports indicate the family purchased a property in the British resort of Hurghada, while others suggest they were staying at the four-star Elysee Dream Beach Hotel. Vladimir was a successful young man, working remotely as an IT specialist, and his friends revealed his passion for music, as he enjoyed recording songs as a hobby. On June 8, 2023, Yuri Popov and his son Vladimir set out to spend a day at a beach near the Dream Beach Hotel in the Egyptian Red Sea Resort of Hergada. The beach was alive with activity as locals and tourists enjoyed the warm waters and sunny weather. While Vladimir's girlfriend joined them, the family laughed, talked, and savored their time together on the sandy shores. Amidst the bustling scene, Vladimir decided to take a refreshing swim to escape the scorching sun while his father remained on the sand, keeping an eye on their belongings and relishing the relaxation. The beach was filled with joyous sounds, as slides splashed into the water, children's laughter filled the air, surfers rode the waves, and upbeat music created a vibrant atmosphere. The Red Sea Resort was well known for its captivating beauty, attracting visitors from around the world with its nightlife and pleasant temperatures throughout the year. The stunning beach and the mesmerizing sea were its main allure, providing a sense of security as a vigilant lifeguard watched over the water, making accidents a rare occurrence. While Vladimir was enjoying his swim, a sudden commotion and piercing screams filled the air. Startled, he turned his head to witness other swimmers hurriedly making their way to the shore, driven by a sense of urgency. Confusion overcame him as people on the sand shouted for him to get out, but the gravity of the situation eluded him. When he finally redirected his gaze towards the vast expanse of the ocean, his heart sank. There he beheld a chilling sight, an immense dark gray dorsal fin ominously encircling him, coming closer with each passing second. Despite his desperate attempt to reach the safety of the shore, fate conspired against him, leaving him as one of the few remaining figures in the treacherous waters. While others successfully escaped the clutches of danger, the shark set its sights on Vladimir, marking him as its hapless prey. As the shark closed in on Vladimir, it lunged forward, sinking its teeth into his body and mercilessly pulling him beneath the water's surface. The horrifying scene unfolded in the recorded footage, revealing his desperate struggle to stay afloat as his body was tossed and dragged by the relentless predator. His legs thrashed and kicked, causing splashes to erupt from the water, while a crimson hue tainted the once serene blue ocean a chilling testament to his fight for survival. Momentarily, an eerie calm enveloped the scene as the water stilled, leaving onlookers speechless and unsure of how to react. Neither Vladimir nor the shark were visible, until suddenly he resurfaced, wounded and determined to swim back to the safety of the shore. Struggling against the unforgiving currents, he cried out for help, a plea that froze the hearts of all who heard it. Papa, help, it hurts! With every ounce of strength, he propelled himself forward, battling against the relentless force of the sea. However, after what seemed like an eternity for Vladimir, the shark emerged from the depths, closing in on him with terrifying aggression, a mere five feet away. In a final desperate plea, he cried out once more, Papa, help me! And in that fateful moment, the massive jaws of the shark gaped open, 
seizing him by the torso and dragging him down into the watery abyss. The sea erupted in a frenzy of churning waves and violent splashes as the shark's powerful body thrashed and rolled, tearing and rending Vladimir's body into pieces. Now completely obscured from view, Vladimir was cruelly snatched away, forever consigned to the depths, never to be seen alive again. The moment the attack commenced, a vigilant lifeguard sprang into action. Swiftly leaping onto a speedboat, he ignited the engine and raced towards the scene with utmost urgency. However, despite his valiant efforts, the lifeguard's arrival was tragically timed, mere seconds after Vladimir's body had been mercilessly pulled beneath the surface, vanishing from sight. The witnesses replayed the harrowing incident in their minds, plagued by the haunting wish that they could have intervened somehow, offering assistance in that fleeting moment. The entire assault unfolded within a matter of seconds, leaving everyone with the bitter realization that there was truly nothing anyone could have done to alter the heart-wrenching outcome. Due to YouTube regulations, I am unable to share the video. However, I have the audio recording of the incident available. Viewer discretion is advised for those who choose to listen. The experience of witnessing his son's harrowing demise must have inflicted unimaginable trauma upon Vladimir's father, Yuri. Helplessly observing his beloved son battling for his life in the vast expanse of the ocean, confronted by a predator as formidable as a shark, Yuri would have keenly felt the crushing weight of his powerlessness. The anguish he endured, hearing his son's desperate pleas for assistance while grappling with the awareness that he was utterly unable to intervene, undoubtedly shattered his heart. The depth of Yuri's sorrow can only be comprehended as an overwhelming and heart-rending tragedy. Prior to the attack, Vladimir's girlfriend had been present in the water. According to witnesses, he urged her to exit the water, thereby preventing her from encountering the same devastating destiny that awaited him. An unidentified Russian woman, visibly devastated and overwhelmed with grief, was observed screaming and weeping on the shore, finding solace in the consoling presence of others. The grisly nature of the scene left a lasting impression on those present, leaving them haunted by the disturbing images that unfolded before their eyes. Following the attack, the shark remained in the vicinity, in plain view of both locals and tourists. Authorities swiftly initiated a search operation, successfully locating the shark. Employing a strategic approach, boats encircled the shark, deploying large nets both ahead and behind the creature, eventually entangling it in its own struggle and rendering it capturable. With the shark captured, it was then hauled onto the shore, where it lay in a helpless state. However, a tragic turn of events unfolded as a crowd of onlookers resorted to a brutal act of violence, using metal bars to mercilessly beat the shark until its demise. Another grim and unforgiving death, marking the end of the shark's life. It had been a tragic end for both men and beast. Authorities announced their plans to conduct a post-mortem examination and launch a thorough investigation to ascertain the underlying causes of the attack. It is widely recognized that shark attacks on humans can stem from various factors. Mistaken identity is one such factor, as humans may bear resemblance to the natural prey of specific shark species. Additionally, sharks may exhibit curious behavior, investigating unfamiliar objects in their environment, including humans. Defensive behaviors, such as territorial defense or protecting offspring, can also trigger aggressive responses from sharks. However, it is crucial to acknowledge that most shark encounters with humans are non-fatal, and sharks typically retreat after an initial bite. The behavior exhibited by the shark in this particular incident was highly uncommon and rare. It is important to note that these resorts have traditionally been popular and regarded as safe destinations. However, over time, 
Memories of such events tend to fade, and people gradually return and forget it happened. Sadly, it may take another incident to remind individuals of the potential risks associated with oceanic encounters. If you found the tragic story of Vladimir Popov intriguing, we appreciate your support by liking, subscribing, and hitting the post notification bell to stay updated with our channel. Feel free to explore more videos by clicking up here. Thank you for being a part of Wildlife Whispers.